Greenville hockey history. The fastest team to 30 wins in a regular season. Oh, it is getting real, and we need you there this weekend because it's coming down to the wire. All right, it is time for Swamp Rabbit. It's the final weekend of the regular season, which is mind blowing because Mark. I feel like it was just January and we're, yeah. you know, when you came on. But we got a lot of fun ways to really close out the season. What are we looking at this weekend? So two out of the next three games are our final two home games of the year starting tonight. Teacher Appreciation Night presented by First Step Realty. Just a way to honor our local educators uh -huh. for all they do for our children and for, for adults as well, pursuing undergraduate and graduate programs as well. So um, it, it's it's a great night. We're going to we're going to have a tumbler giveaway for teachers coming in yes. stuff with a couple of little supplies courtesy of First Step Realty. So a lot of fun there. And then Sunday is Fan Appreciation Night presented by Floor, where the team who has been wearing these bad boys all year in warm up will wear these for a full game. Oh, that's and cool. they will be auctioned off afterwards. So that jersey pays homage to the Greenville Growl. Uh, who celebrated 25 years yes. uh, in the upstate. So. And y'all were fun doing like, you know, big fans earlier in this in the season with that. I love the fate, you know, it's one of my favorites. It's like, let's go. <laughs> exactly, yeah. And, it, and it's a great way to, to, to marry the modern day Swamp Rabbits, yes. the Gilded Age of the Growl, uh -huh. kind of mesh that together. It's hard to believe 25 years of hockey in the upstate is pretty wild. And I mean, it seems like yesterday that, that it was just like, you know, we're getting hockey. You know, the big debate about what's the name going to be? Right, and, right. Absolutely. So it's, it's going to be a great time. Uh, there's also so many things that we're doing Sunday to thank our fans our season ticket holders, corporate sponsors, fans that come to even one game, they're yes. our lifeblood. And so the last game of the year is all for them. And, and so just a great way to thank them for helping us get to this point right now, where as you alluded before we started, it's down to the wire this weekend. The Swamp Rabbits have a chance to win a division title going into the playoffs, and, and it's going to come down to the very last game. Okay, explain what we need to happen right now. Because a lot of the fans are like, okay, we're definitely, we're, we're, we're jumping on at the end. What are we, obviously we're cheering for a W for the Swamp Rabbits, but we need other things to happen too. So basically, the way that it works is we need six points okay. to win a division title. And that's a combination of uh, the Swamp Rabbits winning games and the Jacksonville Icemen directly behind us losing out on games. We have 89 points in the standings, one point ahead of Jacksonville in second, who is three points ahead of Florida in third, who is one point ahead of South Carolina in fourth, who is one point ahead of Orlando in fifth, and the top four get in. So for all five of these teams, it comes down to the wire, whether Ooh. we get a division title, whether we just get home ice advantage, which we've already clinched, whether we still don't even know who our first round opponent's going to be. Oh my gosh. Because there's so many different things that can happen. So uh, they call it the ever-changing hockey league for a reason. Uh. And any given night, it, 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 you just don't know who you're going to play in round one. And that's why it's so fun because everything matters. So you know when you show up, you're going to be getting fantastic hockey. Everybody's leaving it out there on the ice because it, it really matters. This is like crunch time. Absolutely. I mean, it's – and this is – a real showcase of the body of work that the Swamp Rabbits put together this season. You know, setting the the road wins record the way that they did uh, consecutively. Ryan Bednard setting the single uh, the, the franchise shutout record. Mm -hmm. This team becoming the fastest to 30 wins in Greenville professional hockey history, so doing good. 42 games, back to back 40 win seasons. It's it's a true testament to what we did in the regular season to get us to this point, where now there's a chance to to get a division title, get home ice for the first two rounds of the playoffs, and then. Hopefully keep that going all the way to June when our Patrick Kelly's Cup's hoisted over our heads. Let's do it. We need that Kelly Cup. You need to come out this weekend, take advantage of all the offers, and you're doing the family four-pack. That's still available? Yeah, it's the final regular season weekend for the family four-pack tonight and Sunday. Uh, so get your tickets, your hot dogs, your Coke, your chips. Great time for the family and everybody. I love it. You see the information right there on your screen. Come out and support and just enjoy it. Mark, thank you so much. Good luck. Y'all crush it. It's going to be fun.